What's up today, guys? I've got a lot of questions lately about the uh, cooling system in my LS Swapped K5 Blazer. So I figured I'd do a quick video of all the parts I used and uh, we'll go over everything. So the radiator is a factory replacement for a big block Chevy for a square body. I think it is a Spectre Premium CU730, I think is the part number. The uh, mounting top plate is from LMC Truck, just a big block mounting plate for the radiator. The fan shroud is also just a big block replacement for a square body. Upper radiator hose and lower radiator hose are both from a 99 to 2006 Chevy 1500. Uh, upper radiator hose fits perfect. You have to trim the lower radiator, uh, the lower radiator hose just a bit to get it to work. But other than that, I mean, it is money. Everything works great. Uh, I'm running just a factory fan clutch fan and mechanical fan from a 9906 Chevy pickup. Uh, this thing does not overheat. Runs 195 all day long around the highway. Doesn't matter what speed you're going. Uh, you get in traffic, it'll jump up to 205, but it never climbs higher than 205. And that's with the AC blowing ice cold. So it is very efficient cooling system. You don't have to worry about relays, extra wiring, anything like that. I wanted simplicity. I wanted reliability. So I went with a mechanical fan. I'm not worried about horsepower in this application. So the mechanical fan robs 30, 40 horsepower. I'm not, I'm not too concerned with it. I wanted simplicity. I wanted reliability. I wanted availability of parts. If anything was to ever happen while I'm on a road trip, uh, I know Tejas Steelworks, I'm using their motor mounts, I'm using their trans mount. Uh, they have a fan shroud for electric fans, but like I said, I wanted simplicity, I wanted reliability. So I went with a mechanical fan. And this thing, I mean, it'll idle at 205 all day long sitting in traffic. You don't have to worry about it overheating. Uh, I think it is a four core radiator, if I'm not mistaken, being a factory replacement for a big block. And uh, I've just got the factory 195 thermostat in it. Like I said, it, it'll it run 195 all day long down the highway. It don't matter if it's 110 degrees out or 120 degrees out. It's going to run 195. So I just want to do a short, quick video, guys, of uh, explaining my cooling system in my Blazer. Uh, like I said, everything's basically factory replacement or just factory for a 5.3. There's nothing really hard to it. Uh, even the... Like isolators are just factory big block isolators for the bottom and the top of the radiator. So, well, guys, if you like the video, like, comment, subscribe, and we'll catch you next week.